Look how bright it is in this room, it's so warm. Anyway, okay, so I thought I'd make this video to explain wh how I learned How to Lucid Dream. Because obviously I've got this channel, I teach you guys How to Lucid Dream, I've written books, i made courses, like my Udemy course, I'll talk about that in a minute. But how did I actually learn How to Lucid Dream? How did I learn this stuff, right? Well, firstly, I've read tons of books. I don't actually have them all now. All I've got at the moment is... So what have we got here? We've got this one, Lucid Dreaming by Robert Wagner. Uh, we've got Mind Hacks, that has a couple of bits in it. Then these are some books I wrote. And then we've got The Paradox of Lucid Dreaming by Dr. Rory McSweeney. Lucid Supplements Blueprint. And then we've got A Neuronaut by who's this? Simon Rausch. This one is a really famous one, Exploring the World of Lucid Dreaming. And then we've got... So what I started doing, right, so basically I read all of those books. I read every single one cover to cover, as well as a whole load more that I've actually sold or got given to friends. So I guess you could say I sort of learned the same way that everybody else does. I just read a lot of books, read a lot of articles, and tried everything out. Because that's the most important thing, you just got to try this stuff out and see what works, you know. I've gone through several dream journals, like more than I can remember, cover to cover, um, and I've just I've just tried loads of things. I've tried loads of supplements, loads of books, loads of courses. I've just constantly been pushing what I knew about lucid dreaming. Combined that with my sort of, I had a background in psychology and I just sort of learned as much as I could. And you know, anyone could do the same. I don't think you can really call yourself an expert in lucid dreaming simply because it's so subjective and so complicated, you know, that all, all I can say for certain is that I know a lot more than the average person about lucid dreaming. I've pushed the boundaries as far as I possibly can and you know I've still got a lot to learn obviously because everyone has but I've learned as much as I possibly can about this stuff. I've read all of the books I can find, I've taken all the courses, I've tried all the supplements and I've just combined that with loads of trial and error. So pretty much what I would, what I would do for years is I would just try loads of different techniques. I would then combine them with certain supplements, I'd try them at different times of night and day just to try and learn as much as I could about it. And I've always been this way since I was a kid. When I've been interested in something, I've sort of been very obsessive and gone in deep with it. So whether it's, you know, learning the guitar, whether it's learning how to free run or anything, really, rock climbing, website building and things like that, or lucid dreaming, I've always gone in with all I have and learned as much as I could. But that being said, I do now know a huge amount about lucid dreaming and I love sharing the information with everyone. I love sort of giving it back to the community and showing people what I've learned, teaching you guys through videos and that sort of stuff. Up until now, where I have this, this How to Lucid entity or this brand that I've built, I've got this website, this YouTube channel and you know these, these products and everything and it's going really well. And more than anything, I just like sharing what I know with you guys and the best way of me doing that is this YouTube channel. I've pretty much neglected the website recently just because I love making videos and sharing what I know in a, in a more personal way like this. Um, so that's why I created a Udemy, but it's a really good way of learning everything pretty much I know in low videos essentially. So I've spent ages making and it's about lucid dreaming, about how to control your dreams and it's generally it's a really cool way of actually learning how to control your dreams. So one of the first things I did was I brainstormed all of the things I might want to teach people about lucid dreaming. And this included things like, how, what is it, how to get started, the dangers, what you might want to learn, and all of that stuff. I brainstormed all that onto a giant piece of paper. So yeah, I made loads of videos, each one taught a different aspect of lucid dreaming. And it took me about two months, I would say, to film from start to finish. And it's now currently, on Udemy. So you can find it by just going to udemy.com, searching lucid dreaming and looking for the picture that has four dream scenes in one. It's like a, it's split into four pictures. I'll try and put a picture of that here so you can see. So, so yeah, I would film a, a separate video for each particular aspect of lucid dreaming. The idea is as a beginner knowing nothing about lucid dreaming, you can go right from the start of the course right to the end and become like a really experienced competent lucid dreamer. That's the idea at least, anyway.